What's up? It's Jackie, and I am here to do my very last pregnancy update. Thank God. Guys, today is my actual due date. Um, I am due February 26th, and I am just so excited. Um, this is 40 weeks for me, and I guess I'm super excited because of the fact that tonight I will be getting some cervical ripening, although I think that my cervix are pretty ripe right now, um, but they're gonna start um, pitocin on me in the morning and really just kickstart things. Um, the last time I talked to you guys, I was telling you all, I don't even think I told you guys that I was like 75% effaced, but I went for a growth ultrasound at 37 weeks and they wanted me to go because I have the fibroids. I have two fibroids and one was large. So they just wanted to make sure that everything was going good um, with Copeland's growth. And she she did the growth uh, estimate or guesstimate. And it said that at 37 weeks, he was already around 7 pounds and 4 ounces. Of course, that's not accurate all the time. Um, it can be give or take a pound. So I don't know. He could have been like six pounds at that time. He could have been eight pounds at that time. But he's definitely like in the 80th percentile. And they're like, okay, we don't want you to go way too far. Um, that was three weeks ago. So I don't know how big this child is. I just know that he feels really big. In addition to him cramping my entire space, my weight gain was really not that much for this pregnancy. Um, I gained anywhere between 10 to 13 pounds. So this guy is really just eating every single thing. Um, I will say that my last three weeks, my legs and my ankles and my feet kind of exploded. I am so not used to that. It's just so weird seeing my ankles just like blow up. And But you know, all that stuff comes with pregnancy. So I've just been taking it in stride. But I'm just so excited to meet him. Jeff is just over the moon to meet him and we are ready to get stuff going. Um, my grandmother, she is flying in today. She'll get here this afternoon. And then Jeff's mom will be coming on the 14th of March, I think. And then she'll be staying for two weeks. So we're just gonna have so much love around us and family. And we are just so excited. Um, everything seems to be going good. I went for my 39 week checkup. Um, and she said I was like one to two centimeters dilated and I was 80% effaced. So hopefully when I do the cervical ripening and all that good stuff that I can just open right up. Especially because yesterday I also lost my mucus plug. So my body is really getting ready but I can tell that they just don't want me to go too far just because of how big he is. Um, they did say that I still had a good chance of delivering vaginally. Um, so that's what we're going to go for. If it just doesn't work out, I mean, you know, guys, C-sections are, you know, not what they used to be. So I'll be fine as long as baby's fine and I'm good. We really don't care. So we're going to go go through this process together, Jeff and I, and we go tonight at around, well, actually, it's not that late. We actually go at like 4.45 or 5 o'clock, and um, we'll get that going. But I'm just so excited. Guys, thank you so much for going through this whole journey with us. I think we told you guys at what, like 14 weeks? And now here we are at 40 weeks, which just seems like it went so fast. Um, but I am so excited. We will be trying to take cameras and stuff with us. We'll show you as much as we can, um, vlog as much as we can. I'm not promising that we'll have like a full blown out video, but we will have some sort of footage and some pictures for you guys. And we will get to meet our little guys so, so soon. And let me go ahead and show you guys the bump. This is the bump right now. Definitely big. This guy has definitely grown like crazy and we cannot wait to meet him. Bye. 